Currently, the zoo is building their new habitats where 12 new penguins will begin to explore their new home and form a new colony right here in El Paso. Let's take a first-hand look at their new penguin exhibit. Come on, follow me. Let's meet the person in charge of constructing this large, wonderful habitat and take a sneak peek inside the exhibit. Hello, Andres. Hey, how's it going? Good. You're doing a wonderful job. Can we take a sneak peek inside? Whoa, whoa. Safety first. Excellent. Perfect. Thank you. Let's go. Let's go. Andres, you're doing a great job in building this Rocky Coast natural habitat setting. Tell us, how did it come from to fusion? Uh, what is the process and how are you making this come to life? Well, basically we reached out to an uh, expert outside of El Paso because you know this is a desert. So we don't really bring penguins in here most, most of the time. Of course. So we brought in contractors that have done this before. We got, uh, I believe some of them from Colorado, some of them from Florida and some from uh, Eastern Texas. They're experts in the actual exhibit itself. And they're the ones that did all this uh, rock rock work. Oh, interesting. Make, it gives it that rocky setting that the penguins are used to. Exactly. And you also have a VIP area. Sure, too. Let's go check it out. Yes, let's go. Wow, that's great. And now, Andres, seeing the outside, we're all very anxious to take a sneak peek inside. Can we go inside? Yes, let's go. All right. Andres, let's stop and, and see this. Before we go inside, tell us about this room right here. Yes, of course. This is the LSS uh, system. This basically is the aquatic system for the exhibit tank itself. It cleans the water, removes bacteria, all that. More like of a filter? Yes. Oh, wow. Let's take a look inside. Yes, of course. After. Let's take a look around. Oh, cool. After you. Oh, thank you, thank you. Wow. So this is where the penguins are going to be right here. Yes, sir. This right here is the beach area. And then, of course, this will be filled up with water and that will be their, their pool. Oh, how awesome. And over here, we have these caves. There's 14 caves. If you look. This, it's closed right now, but this is a door. Right now, we'll take a look inside. You'll be able to see we have the kennels on the other end okay. where penguins will be able to go in through. And that's how zookeepers will be able to take them in to the back of the house. 14 of these, so the penguins are gonna come through right here and, and go in there and I guess we'll be calling them through baits, their names or something. That's correct. <laughs> and these plants up here? They're all artificial plants. To give it that to rocky? It that southwestern look, yes. Awesome. And this, what's this right here? That right there is your skimmer box. It's what you see in normal pools. So this gets lifted up for maintenance access. Oh, okay. This is part of the filtration system. Another cool feature that we added, the zookeepers were afraid of falling into the pool. So we did add these little handles right here. So zookeeper can walk in and not fall. But it's made for it. You see one there, and you got some there. This trap door is actually for feeding the penguins. This is where you'll have your uh, fish to feed the penguins. Oh! This is where they'll store it. It's, it works as a nice box. So this room right here is what you call the nest box. This is what they call it. Okay. So this is the backside of the cave work. This is how the back of those uh, caves that we saw on the front look like on our on this end. Is that why this color, the uh, also the, uh, is this an aesthetic look inside a cave? Yes, this is also an aesthetic. Yes. Oh, I love it. This is a foam. It also helps with insulation. Keep the you know keep this area insulated at the perfect temperature that the penguins need. Oh. So each one of these are numbered to make it easier for the zookeeper. Here are the shelves that will hold the kennels from where the penguins will be going into and where 
we will be able to, uh, the zookeeper will be able to transport him into the back of the house. Can you show us how how, how I would work? For example, you pull this off. Set your kennel in place. This will be closed. So, if you pull here, it'll open it up. Penguin could come in. You would keep this closed. Once the penguin is in, you shut the door, and then now you can take the penguin anywhere you'd like. That's a great way to do it. Now getting to call the penguins out, that's going to be a, a pretty tricky. <laughs> I believe so. <laughs> Matilda! Matilda! Uh, uh, have you seen Matilda? It's her medical checkup next. Matilda! This exhibit is another opportunity to connect our visitors with nature and experience a new adventure. Thank you for following us and if you'd like to see more videos like this, make sure to like us, share and subscribe. We will see you on the next one.